Hello my dear friends, welcome back to Infigyan. Today we have one very interesting and challenging question from algebra. Cubic x cube minus 3x square minus x minus 7 equal to 0 is known equation whose roots are x1, x2, x3. Then it is set to evaluate 1 over x1 square minus 1 plus 1 over x2 square minus 1 plus 1 over x3 square minus 1. So let's get started by considering required expression equal to e. Now I will consider 1 over x1 square minus 1 as y1. We will call 1 over x2 square minus 1 as y2 and 1 over x3 square minus 1 we will consider this is y3. So we are going to evaluate y1 plus y2 plus y3. So we can think about one cubic equation in y whose roots are y1, y2, y3. So we are trying to find out or figure out that cubic equation in y. So let us write y in general form. y is equal to 1 over x square minus 1. Of course, x cannot be equal to plus minus 1. We will cross multiply or multiply both sides by x square minus 1. We will get y times x square minus 1 equal to 1. Now we will divide both sides by y. By writing y cannot be equal to 0, denominator cannot be 0, this y and y will be over, we will get x square minus 1 equal to 1 over y. Let's add 1 to both sides. So I will write x square minus 1 plus 1 equal to 1 over y plus 1. So plus and minus 1 will be over. We will get x square equal to 1 over y plus y over y. So we will write here y plus 1 over y. So our final result x is square equal to y plus 1 over y. This equation we will call equation number 1. Now we will write the given cubic equation x cube minus 3x square minus x minus 7 equal to 0. Now I will take minus 3x square to the RHS and minus 7 to the RHS. We will get x cube minus x in LHS and 3x square plus 7 in the RHS. Now we will take x common from here knowing x square is y plus 1 over y which we are going to utilize. So I will write x times in bracket x square minus 1 in the LHS. In RHS we will write 3x square plus 7. Now we have x square known. This is our equation 1 y plus 1 over y. Let us apply. So we will get x times y square. We will write here y plus 1 over y minus 1 equal to 3 times x square is y plus 1 over y. Then we will write plus 7. Let's simplify. x in the bracket will write y plus 1 minus y. Denominator will be y. In RHS we will write 3 times y plus 1 plus 7y over y. Now plus and minus y we can cancel. We will be writing x over y in the LHS. In RHS, 3y plus 3 
plus 7y and denominator is y. Now we can multiply both sides by y to cancel our denominator. So I can write here times y and this side also we will write times y. So this y will be cancelled out from our denominator. We will get equation x equal to 10y plus 3. So I will write x equal to 10y plus 3. Now we will write our equation 1. x square is equal to y plus 1 over y. Now we have to only apply this x value here. So I will write 10y plus 3 whole square equal to y plus 1 over y. Let's use a plus b whole square identity. We will get 10y whole square 100y square plus 2 times 10 times 3. We will get 60y. 3 square is 9. RHS will be equal to y plus 1 over y. Now we will multiply again by y both sides. So let's multiply by y. This side also will write times y. This y and y will be cancelled out. We will get our equation 100yq plus 60y square plus 9y equal to y plus 1. Now take all the terms to left hand side. We will get 100y cube plus 60y square plus 9y minus y. So we will write 8y and then minus 1 equal to 0. So finally we have one cubic equation in y. Now our required expression was y1 plus y2 plus y3. So this is sum of roots. We will calculate using Vita's method from our cubic equation. So if roots are y1, y2, y3, then sum of roots will be equal to minus of coefficient of y square, so 60, over coefficient of y cube, 100. So we can write LHS will be our required expression E and RHS will come out minus 3 over 5. So this is our final answer. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye bye.